Hey everyone, Piano Man Chuck here, and I'm here today to talk about how to get more power out of your Roland KC110 portable stereo keyboard amp. Now this keyboard amp can run on AC power where it gives you 30 watts of power, but it also has the ability to run on 8 AA pen light batteries and when you do so you have the freedom of being liberated from an AC wall outlet but that freedom comes at a price when you're running on batteries the power of this drops down to 20 watts so you're losing one-third of the power right off the bat just for the privilege of being able to run on batteries and for a lot of people me included I thought, okay, that's a small trade-off. And if you don't believe me that you lose from 30 to 20 watts, go look at the specs. It'll tell you right there, 20 watts on batteries, 30 watts on AC power. Okay, so like I was saying, I thought it was a small trade-off just to be able to run on battery power. And for me, as a gigging pianist, I had this... Casio Privia PX5S that runs on eight pen light or AA batteries. It was a professional piano, so it only weighs 24 pounds. So I was all set there. But then I got this other Kurzweil piano, which it had this brick. So basically one end you plug into the AC wall outlet, the other end converts it over to 15 volts DC, and that plugs into the DC power input and the way I had around that is I bought this RAV power model number RP-PB14 with switchable voltages long story short you take the supplied cable and whatever kind of adapter that fits into your DC input and now all of a sudden I can run this keyboard without AC power. I can take this anywhere in the world. So wow, that was a great find for me. But I took this a step further because since I've done that, I realized that I know that the Roland KC110, this keyboard amp right here, stereo, is only 30 watts while you're plugged into the wall. And when you're running on batteries, it drops down to 20 watts. So the way around that is it knows you're plugged into the wall because you have got on this side here a DC in. And when something is plugged into that DC in, it figures you're no longer using the batteries. You're using the wall outlet AC power, and it gives you the full 30 watts. And that's where this comes in because you take this and you plug the supplied cable in, you find the required adapter to fit into the DC in of the Roland. You put this in here, you plug that into the DC power of the Roland, and not only do you now get the full 30 watts out of your Roland KC110, you can also play just about all day long because on batteries you got maybe three hours if you push it maybe four hours with this <laughs> you can really play all day long and it's got actually an indicator on here to tell you what percentage of the battery is left and i've been using this for a couple hours already and as far as this knows it tells me that I've got 97% power left. How cool is that? So from now on rather than using batteries on this Roland KC110 I'm going to be using this RAV power portable power supply and get myself a full 30 watts. So now it's like I've just gotten an upgrade on my battery-operated portable stereo keyboard amp for just the price of this RAV power unit. 
Now, for those interested, it's called Rav Power, R A V P O W E R. The not the model number is R P dash P B fourteen, and you can go to their website, which is ravpower.com. Hope this video has really improved your outside gigging experiences. Piano Man Chuck, peace out. Thanks for watching.